You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and you just landed on Bin Day, and this is pretty much my history in a bin for slimes, putties, goos, and all the stuff that I've shown you probably in the last, I bet you this goes back at least four years. Some items in there, maybe that'll be a fun thing to do, figure out the oldest item in here based on the video. Now I see some lizard slime, which I did recently, because that's where I kept it. This here I got at a garage sale, never opened up. Not sure it's any good. There's some Halloween in there, some Christmas. This Jeepers Creatures, I don't know where it's at. This bin actually got played with by my kids, so it's time for me to clear it out, clean it out, dump it all on the table, and make a big mess. That sounds exciting, doesn't it? So let me move the bin off to the side, and then I'll just start separating it and then spilling it out. All right, so let's just clarify first. I hope you don't think this is a waste. If you know Lucky Penny Shop and me, you will know I save everything. I've pretty much saved everything. So what I'm going to keep for now is the putties because I don't want to mix those into the slimes. The slimes are going bad. The last time the kids were in this, uh, it turned out to be, hmm, I couldn't use that, couldn't use that. This is a Silly Putty Hulk. That's on video, so you can find all this on video, but what's gonna be the oldest video? I don't know. Stocking stuffers, I bet you this goes back to 2012. Silly putties. All right, now look at this. This is a My Little Pony glitter putty, but it's all dried up in there, even though I tried to seal it back up. So that's something we'll put over there. Now this, you recently saw in a video, so I am going to open up the ones I didn't open up before. And this is play foam. And it still is squishy. So I think I'm going to actually put that in a video today. Here, let me turn the brightness down just a little. Is that better? Okay, I went up first before I went down. So let's keep that. Here, I'll put everything behind that I'm gonna use. Here is a Monster Lab putty. It's my creation, we'll keep that off to the side. This was from Valentine's, uh, not Valentine's, Halloween last year, not this year. This is from Halloween, so this is something I can dump on the table. This was recent, this was that moon putty, so we will save that. This is a Crazy Aaron's Thinking Putty brochure. Pretty neat, didn't realize I had that in there. Too bad I crunched it all up. All right, this is slime, volcano slime. That's something that we're gonna... These have already been put in video, I'm pretty sure. And then I repackage it and try to close it back up for this day. This is the culmination of this. Lizard slime, spew goo, I know that stuff's going bad. There's a video of that. More foam, that's a keeper. Now this is something that's a silly putty, so I'll keep that. I'm gonna. Try to organize my putties and slimes better. Another silly, pu silly putty. And then this, we'll see if it's any good. This is Guzerk, I believe. This tar, it still looks like it's usable, but it's definitely lost some consistency there. So we'll dump all that out. The plan is just to dump it all out so I can clean up and get ready for future videos. All right, here's another silly putty sports. Spider putty, let's do this. Let's make a little room here. This, I don't know about this. When I shook it, there's hard bits in there, but I'll dump it out if you think it's gonna work. This uh, is a putty, so I'm gonna put that off to the side. This is an old one, I believe I made. I don't even know what this, it's a gelato container that I saved. Boy, I saved a lot of stuff. More of this, this. As you can see, I will show you what happens, like that tar putty has been leaking out, so that's no good. This has got something in it. Let's just see. It's it's still good. All right. Let's just get in here a little bit more. Now look what I'm saying. See how this has gone totally bad. And this is what happens. I try to keep it, but some things are just not meant to keep, and it's time to clean house. And that's what I've been doing. Another melting... Putty. This is a was a let's see bouncing putty. We'll keep the putties. I got lots of Santas and stuff in here. This guy looks like his he's a goo spilled out. Got a spider here. 
Got this flump. This one is slime. This is an original slime, I believe. I got to look at the year on that one. 2012. All right, here's another Pluto Plasma. Looks to be pretty bad. Here's a barrel of slime, but look at that. Ooh, should I dump that out on the table? My plan is just to make this, dump it all out. Now that we've somewhat organized it. Zombie Pocket Putty. It's been opened and retaped. Here's some packaging. Like I said, this was played with, so some of it just wasn't restored correctly. Mega Head Goo. Mega Head Goo. I actually put that back in the packaging. All right, there. That looks like something we can slime out. Switching to the other side, if you get a change. Here's some green snotty slime. This looks like, yeah, I don't know. It's hard to tell if I use that. Maybe a version of it. A balloonies package. So I got to put some stuff off to the side here. Here is a Angry Birds putty. Silly putty. Stocking stuffer putty. Oh, this looks like it's good. This was a mutagen ooze. More putties. I mean slimes. Let's get the putty. The putty. Once I get it to a point, then you're going to see a real mess on your hands. I just can't save it anymore. It's not... It's going bad. And I feel like this is the best way to show it to you. Just dump it all out. I got two more of these. That? I don't know what that is. The magic snow. I saved it. Let's dump it in there. Ooh, something in there. That's a little alien. I remember this video. I still get comments on that video that I killed the aliens. Oh, another barrel. Oh, here's some Orbeez. I've got a whole pack of those. I'm glad I found those. And then another melting zombie. There's a video on that. Maybe someone can tell me the oldest item in this. Now this one is definitely not this color. It's brownish now. Didn't start out that way. What's this? Glow dough. Oh yeah. Let's throw that in there. Mood mud. I still get comments on this one because I didn't follow the directions exactly, even though it says color changes by touch. I bet you this is one of the older ones. It never changed color. So I put some in the, I think I put it in the, ref the freezer and I was supposed to put half in the microwave and everybody said I did it wrong, but it didn't really matter because it doesn't work. Let's get more of that there. Okay, putties, putties. The goo blanks is missing. Okay. Oop, there's another one. There's a Jeepers Creepers. The rest is just rot zombie slime. All right, so what you see now. Oh, here's some crazy errands. Little brochures. They must have sent me a long time ago. Still in good condition. Oop, one more there. Okay, so I'll clean this out later. I'll put all the stuff I'm keeping for now back in. And then uh, we're going to throw you aliens in there. Okay, so I'll be back. And then I'm going to move this off to the side and dump it all on the table and just start messing around with it, slopping it up, seeing what we can create. I'll be back. All right, no rhyme or reason here. Let's just start opening them up, dumping out, and see what's left. Now, I thought I made this one, but let's see the consistency of it now. Oh, yeah, totally, totally messy. Let's get this guy out. Now, look, if it's hardened like this and cracked, I'll set it there because it's not going to do us much good. This one had the lid off, so look at that kind of messy. I have to just throw it away. It's so hard to throw things away that have so much history here. Let's see this spider. Okay, so this to me, even though it's called putty, is not really a putty. Goodbye to that. Here's some spew goo. And then here's another spider putty. We'll put those all together. I think this will be fun just seeing what happens. Here's a blue flump. And then here, this one looks pretty messed up. This, oh, this is liquid. This one I can't put out. See, some of these I will not be able to put out because they're just so 
messed up. Look at that. It's like a liquid now. Can't use that one. Another Spoo Here, this one I could put on. I think this one's still somewhat salvageable. Come on. Work with me. Wow, it's really in there. I don't remember being that difficult before, but I think it's lost its lost its life. Cool container though, that I might keep. Here is a potty putty. Let's see, is this any good? No, let's turn hard. Okay. Metallic slime. All right, here's another slime. Ooh, look at that. Oh yeah, that's some good slime. Gonna make it hard for me to open anything, but let's just mush what we got now. I don't know how long this video is gonna take. Could take a while. You get in here. I remember making you. That's cool. Now some of it's not breaking down. You can just tell it. It's not gonna, it's not gonna, not gonna have fun with me. Look at that spugu. That had little pieces of plastic in it. I don't know if you remember that video. Let me know what videos you remember or don't remember. All right, let's do this. Let's see if we can get this out of a bag. This was Halloween, not this year, but last year. Now oh, my hands are sticky. It was in an IV bag, I believe. It was called IV putty or something, or IV slime. If you see any edits, it's because I had to cut something or, you know, wash my hands and I'll come back. I'll try to warn you. Look at that one. Ugh. Yeah, what's this one? This one looks good. Oh, hardened up. Nah, not bad. Oh, this one's purple. Okay. Let's see if this slime from the Black Lagoon. Oh. Look at that. Okay. Let's see what else we can bring out here that's easy to reach. That one's no good. This one was bad. Let's check out the other side. I got on both sides of the table. Here's another barrel of slime. There went a lid. Okay, this is a, another barrel of slime, but a red one. Ooh, with an eyeball in it. Kind of remember that video. Here's a potty putty. Let's see if it's bad like the other one. Oh yeah, totally hard. No reason to keep it anymore. And I don't know what's in this barrel. Let's see. Black. Oh, that was disgusting. Here's another galactic one. Okay, let's just use this as our blocker right now. You stay over there, keep that. Let's see, oh, is that weird? Oh, there's an eyeball floating around. I probably should just mix this in a big bowl, but. All right, I got some containers that I need to open, so I'm gonna do that. Maybe I'll soak up just that liquid, because this looks like it 
held itself there. And I'll be back. That looks cool. I think it's starting to look pretty neat. I will come back. I want to get the containers that are still in plastic out. Okay, so I have isolated the aliens and thought, oh look, they came apart. Uh-oh. I'll get abused for that, for abusing those aliens. But that's okay. It doesn't bother me, everybody. I just say it because I just think it's funny. There we go. Not funny in a way that I'm hurting your feelings, but just, you know, they're plastic. And I got those all set so that I can just do that. Now what you see in the top right corner, those are all hard, unusable. And then let me see if I can get this out with my turtle. This one is hard to open. It is not easy. Oh, there we go. Get the turtle in there. Okay, now some of these, these are all hard. I can't do much with them. But we'll just see. See, hard as a rock. Not much use to them. So all that's done. I got a few more. This is like a... Oh, no. Let's just throw that in there. Rainbow something. I got one of these. I can't do them all because they're just not in the best shape. Here's that powder. I don't know what that's going to do. First, let's get it open. Let's put it here. And then... Let's get the foam in here. This will make an interesting mix, huh? And then let's see if this is any good. This is that big... foam. It's from 2012, four years old. It's, I'm gonna say, I don't know what I'm gonna say. I might, we might be okay. What I heard moving around was the, the pieces in there. What's in here? Oh, little, little molds. I had no idea. Let's just see, oh, it has like a weird liquidy consistency to it. Oh. To throw it in the mix. Bet you didn't think this was going to happen today. I guess ultimately my goal here is just to mix it all up and see what kind of mess I can make. And I think I've done just that. Yeah, it's kind of wet. It's not like it should be. Let's get this color out. I can't wait. I'm trying to get through this quick because I just want to squish this up. Okay, I got 90% of what I took out. Some of it I just can't get to or it looks like it's bad. So at least we know now I can get rid of it. Okay. Oh, this one I opened this one. Let's just throw that on top. All right, what do you think that is? About 30 different slimes, putties, and stuff here. I got to get rid of this. Lots of memories with this one. Still, till this day, like I said, I get comments on that video. And let's throw this in for an oddball. Oh, it's bad. Okay, can't throw that in. This blue one was messed up. I got a few blacks, but yeah, it's all wet. That's going to go in the garbage. All right. So I hope you don't think I'm wasting. I am now going to squish this all up. Looks pretty colorful. Let's just see. Oh, that feels good. That feels good in my hands. Well, now you see the difference between foam and the play foam. Two totally different size foam dots. I'll try to stop and just let you study that. But I do want to get everything out of the perimeter. There's just a couple more things, but I think we cleared out a bunch of it.
Ew, there's hair in there. <laughs> it's bound to happen when so many people, well, so many people. I have had friends and family in this. It's a fun time at the Lucky Penny shop. If I have friends come over, I'll pull out the crazy iron bin and just go through all the putties. It's pretty neat. They're fascinated by it. People ask me, what do your friends think of you? I don't know. They love it. One day I had some friends over and we just set up every, well, of course, with their kids as well. Every single hex bug I had. Huge layout on the ground outside. That is pretty cool. At least I think it is. Ooh, there's my nemesis. You're not changing colors, are you? No, you're not. But you're stretching really cool. We've got something. That one shot. You get out of here, spider. You can't be in there. Same with your buddy. This one is pretty shot. We will dispose of you. This one, yeah, it's not going to break down. Let's see if we can get Spider out. I do like to keep the toys inside. So we will save you. I don't think that'll ever break down. I just love the foam in there. That is the coolest. I guess my goal here now is to see if this will ever turn into something. I promise you I will not keep it either. I will have to throw it out. Let me start getting things out that I find that I'm going to keep. Get over here, little lizard. Come here, buddy. This is a hard piece of the alien. Ooh, look at the alien. I'm going to rip his legs. Don't be mad. It's just plastic. Rubber. You get here. Let me get him in there. You are not breaking down. So is this purple one. I thought adding the foam would give it some friction to kind of help break it down. See that? Let's see. Let's take this with some fresh foam. It helps. I don't know. I think it's somewhat pretty. Slightly disgusting, but pretty. And I gotta tell you, it feels cold and nice on the hands. This is the time of year. Ooh, my ring came off. Did you see that? That's never happened before. It slimed off. I'm putting it back on. At this time of year, when your hands get colder, I don't know, my ring seems to be looser. But my hands also start to get drier at this time of the year. So this is the time of year to increase the moisture content.
So the ones that aren't officially totally breaking down, I'm going to have to just start piecing out because they won't, ooh, an eyeball. They'll never break down. They'll just remain chunky. And I'm trying to get to a consistency. Oh, I feel something in there. What is that? Ooh. It's a pterodactyl. I think it's a pterodactyl. This one, I don't think will ever break down. Well, that's what I wanted to find out. See, now what would you do? Would you save this in a big giant tub? Or would you throw it out? That's my dilemma. That's why I reached this point. There, I think I got it where it's a nice consistency color probably because of the little colored foam will not change much more than this. But I've taken out all the stray chunks. There might be a few stragglers. You guys go. You guys go. See, they don't really stick in there either. That was the rainbow one. Say goodbye to the rainbow. I think I got it where I want it now. Now I'll just mess with this a little bit. So what do you think is the oldest product here? I'm going to go with the one of those mood muds. That mood mud. I know that video is from a long time ago. I'd have to check. I can't right now, so you can check. Just type in. If you want to find anything Lucky Penny Shop, just type in mood mud Lucky Penny Shop. And read the last comments about me doing it wrong. I think that one was from 2012 maybe. I don't know. I'm curious to find out. Now I'm really happy with the consistency. I'd say that's pretty cool looking. I can bring the camera in without actually adjusting it. Just through the editor. I'll probably do that. Get you real close so you can see. I'll just let that sit a second. leave it off now. It's so soft and smooth you don't feel it. it just gets in, pulls it right off. 
And yes, it's easy to wash. I've had people say, why do you leave it on? Because I rarely take it off. Bad luck. Bad luck. You take it off now. It gets stuck in this pile. Then someone doesn't realize it. And it gets thrown out. Then you're in trouble. So you have to be very cautious. I don't know if it's truly bad luck. I don't do it often. There, I like this now. I think I have exactly what I was going for. And look, I can pretty much lift the whole block up. It doesn't stay stuck. Oh, look. You know where there, turtle? We'll keep him. I think we've hit our color. I'm not sure it's going to change. I mean, it might meld into more of a brown, but it's kind of like a violety, purpley, pinkish. I like that though. take to clean this up. I would like to give you a different camera angle, but well, maybe I'll do that. Let me just reset my camera. All right, look at that. Here's the leftovers. It's got a definitely a different sound, different consistency to it. More Squishy, alien head, alien head. Yeah, not much I could do with that. Let's get these guys out of the way so we don't get any stuck back in there. Well, I don't know, maybe we can just throw them back in. It's part of the fun. Turtle, who he landed, and he landed right side up. I'll have to get them out before I'm done, but they look kind of cool in there. The lizard and the spider, look at that. Well, there you go. Not much more I can do. I think it's turned into a nice color. Now I can clean that bin out and start all over again with new buddies and new stuff. There's my blob. Here, I'll put them side by side. Look at this blob. This is still kind of cool. I mean, I'd probably still play with this. Don't touch. Don't touch. Stop. There's the line. Don't cross the line. All right. I'm going to end it there. I'm going to say thanks for watching. Hey, look at it. Right when I grab an eyeball. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I had no idea how long this was going to take, but I'm satisfied with it. I think we've got a lot of good squishy sounds. And now I can start over with some fresh stuff for you. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'm not sure what playlist I'm going to put this in just yet. 
the bin day playlist how's that and look at that description if you like putty slimes because all of this has been on video and thanks for watching later if you're looking for the item you just saw in the video click here watch more videos by clicking here don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up hey lps dave what's up butch make sure they don't forget to subscribe oh yeah please click here to subscribe to lucky penny shop and always remember when you see a lucky penny pick it up <laughs>